Let's see, so the Oh my god. Hello everyone, welcome back to the beautiful streets of Lome. Guess what guys, I'm taking you all to Asigame. You know, I've done street food in Asie, I've done street food in Ajidogome. And today we are doing street food in Asigame. This is the biggest, I would say one of the biggest market in West Africa. And yeah, come with me guys, let's see what people eat in Asigame. The first thing I got was roasted cassava and oh my god, so crunchy and fluffy in the inside with some pear. It was really really amazing and I got cassava for 100 francs. Yeah, that's how cheap you can get food in Asigame. When I got to Asigame, it was quite early, it was 8 a.m. and the people are still taking breakfast. As you can see, this lady is preparing cocoa and akara from beans yeah so people were still taking breakfast and i was like why not yeah so here we were getting like a uh, cocoa you know in ghana they call it cocoa as well i think and nigeria the same thing it's made from fermented corn or you can call it pap in cameroon we call it pap so that's exactly what they were selling here so they were still like preparing it i came why they were still preparing it yeah so right here i got cocoa for like 100 francs and akara for 100 francs very hot and sweet oh my god you know coco has this sweet and sour taste and it's really really amazing oh. You know, in Togo, a lot of people eat Aimulu for breakfast. Aimulu is like the key. Oh my god, everybody loves it. It's basically rice with limestone and stew. So, so delicious. Yeah, so you can see a lot of people are buying this for breakfast. Like, it's quite cheap as well, so everybody can afford it. As from 100 francs, you can get um, Aimulu and maca which is spaghetti and is really really delicious so a lot of people love it here in togo because it's very very affordable yeah So beside the local dishes in Togo you can get like pizza this is like 2000 francs and you know burgers you can get potato fries for like 1000 francs per plate yeah everything is in togo guys <laughs> yeah so while we were walking in asigame heavenly was like she wanted apples and uh, i got four apples for 500 francs one is 125 francs but if they are really tiny you can get one for 100 francs and she enjoyed it you know very fresh and sweet yeah it's so delicious yeah, so apart from that, I wanted to get um, my breakfast as well and I got um, French bread and eggs. Yeah, this is my favorite. Like when I leave the house very early and I don't take my bread, my breakfast, sorry, this is what I usually get because they prepare it like fresh for you. As you guys can see, he's about to fry my eggs and you know, the bread and yeah very very delicious so i got one egg for 125 francs and i got bread for 100 francs and tea which is 100 francs making it 325 francs yeah this is like a mobile restaurant in togo okay because a lot of people will leave the house very early without eating so while you are in the market you can quickly you know get something from them you know they can fry like spaghetti and eggs and they have like french bread they have tea all kind of flavors oh my god you know they have like this mint uh tea they have lipton usually i'll just go with mint and lipton and some um 
lemon and sugar oh my god it's so good please if you are in togo try the tea from these people and tell me and usually men are the one doing it it's so good and it's affordable as well it's affordable yeah so i really enjoy what i got even though the hygiene is not perfect but it's okay you know why he's doing the cooking he will kill all the bacteria and yeah anyways i enjoyed something something uh, we have a little little bit Have a strong The tea is so good. Oh my god. 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 The tea is so good. It's really hot in the market today. It's quite early. So hot. I think they have a needle. One, two, three, go. Say hello. One, two, three, go. Where do you want to go to? Hey? Where? Say hello. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, go. Apart from Aimulu in Togo, there is jollof rice, okay? Because a lot of people think maybe uh, people in Togo don't eat jollof rice. They eat a lot of jollof rice here as well and they do it so well. It's similar to the jollof rice in Ghana. Yeah, so this is exactly what it looks like. It's being sold with stew as well with some chicken. Yeah, really, really good. And uh, a plate is just... 100 francs, you know, you can get for 100 francs 200 or 300. It depends on the amount of rice you can eat you know you cannot do street food in a cigarette without talking about turkey tail but it's quite expensive i don't know why these women are selling these things so expensive though can you imagine that one is like 1500 and the smaller ones are like 1000 that's like two us dollars for one i'm like you guys be coming down so if you are visiting togo as well try this it's really really delicious yeah it's more for 500 
imagine that I got one guava for 100 francs in Togo. In Cameroon, all this guava for 100 and I will not buy. <laughs> Things are very different over here. Oh, jeez. Yeah, so what Pamelon as well, you know, they have like slices for 100 as well, 50 francs as well. Watermelon in Togo is quite cheap, but in guavas are not your maid, I swear. Yeah, so from there, I was feeling thirsty and I went to get myself coconut, you know, the coconut water because it's so refreshing, especially when the sun is very hot. Yeah, so one coconut is 150 francs. I was really lucky because the one I got was so sweet. Oh my gee, it was so sweet. Yeah, so one is 150 francs and she will go ahead and cut it open for you. You know, you will take the juice and there is this jelly inside, the coconut jelly as well. You can eat it if you want. Yeah, so it's really, really refreshing. Yeah. You want to drink? No? Drink juice. Mm -hmm. Heavily drink. So it was really fun doing the street food here in Asigame. I had fun, I ate a lot and finally we are in the car going home oh my god the traffic is so hot like you guys can see there is street food everywhere left and right yeah i had fun i couldn't eat anymore and i was like nah it's time for me to go home <laughs> anyways if you enjoyed the video please make sure you like comment share and subscribe and please share it really helps the video yeah so i hope you enjoy the rest of the video